Megan. This is the first time I've ever made a YouTube video, um, but I was looking online for hair extension reviews and I kind of had a hard time finding exactly what I was looking for and I actually Snapchatted my favorite YouTuber, Alana Davidson, and I said, hey, can you do a review on some different hair extension brands? And I realized that I should probably just do it myself. So there are certain colors and links and all of that that I was looking for specific reviews on. And because I couldn't really find them, I figured I'd just make my own. So this is a total first attempt. I don't know if I'm ever actually going to put this online. I don't know. So we'll just see how this goes. Um, but I'm about to do a hair extension review on the Irresistible Me 16 inch 100 gram hair extensions in Ash Blonde. And I'm going to do the um, Bellamy Bambina 20 inch, I think 200 gram uh, hair extensions in Ash Brown. So I'm going to do the best I can um, in giving you guys the information that you might be looking for. Um, and I'm also going to put them in at the end of the review just so you can see what they look like with my specific hair. If you have hair that is similar to my color or my length or um, the volume that my hair has. And you can kind of see and compare and see if maybe either one of these brands works for you. I will go ahead and say that I had a really good experience with both companies. Um, both of them came, were shipped to both of them were shipped to me um, within a week, which was great because neither one of those brands are located near South Carolina, and that's where I'm ordering too. And so I think in five days is when I got both of mine. Um, I am very new <laughs> to the hair extension game. I have never even thought about wearing hair extensions before until two of my friends got married and they wore hair <laughs> extensions for their weddings, and I was like, Oh my gosh, they took their hair to the next level. I didn't wear them for my wedding. I have long hair anyway. I never thought that I would need them. I will specify I don't need them. My grandfather used to always say need is a very strong word. I don't need them, but um, I, it just takes your hair to the next level if that's something that you're looking for. If you're having a bad hair day or a greasy hair day or you just feel like being lazy with your hair and you're on your way to work, Hair extensions are a really good option for just taking it up to the next level, making it look like you actually tried, when in reality we were being lazy. So that's why I got them. My first set that I got was the Bellamy. And so I'm gonna go ahead and show them to you. Um, I have mine in a Lancome bag, um, and I know that you're supposed to hang them up, but I didn't feel like buying the special hanger thing. Of course, y'all can see reviews on how they come. I don't like to do first impression anything because I feel like first impressions on my part are always wrong. And so I usually hate things with a first impression. So these are the 20 inch Bellamy hair extensions and they are so long. Like, I don't even understand how anybody could wear 22 inches of this hair. And not only that, there's so much hair. And you can kind of see the West, blah, 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 whatever, I think. And these are just so well made. You can tell right off the bat that these are really high quality. Um, they have like a kind of a specific smell to them which is interesting, but you can see that they actually match my hair really beautifully. So I wore these for my 27th birthday party, and oh my gosh, they looked so, so good. My husband, first of all, he's super kind of oblivious and stuff like that, and he didn't realize I was wearing hair extensions, which meant they looked natural, until like 30 minutes in, he was like, girl, your hair is so long and beautiful. I mean, he could not get enough of it. So. The fact that it was natural enough that it wasn't noticeable right off the bat, but all of a sudden, you know, you your hair just looks voluptuous and beautiful like a supermodel. And hey, what girl doesn't want to feel that way? So anyway, that's what I'll, I'll show them to you. I'm going to style them. They hold curl so, so well. Just see just in this three clip left how much hair is in there. And I'm actually going to compare these now to the Irresistible Me's. Okay, so I got the Irresistible, irresistible Me's in a different color. I wanted to do something a little lighter because my hair is really kind of light at the top, but I am so gray. So if you can see, <laughs> I don't know if I'm doing this in the camera or not, but 
I have a ton of gray in my hair and so I wanted to kind of bring some of that lighter ash into the bottom part of my hair. Um, so I got these. Now these are the Irresistible Me's. Um, actually pretty similar. They both have the lace weft. Um, they're a little thinner. You can kind of see them side by side. And obviously the color is different and the length is different. These are in 16 inch and these are great for just day to day wear. These are definitely for like amping it up. These are for what I wear to work some days. Honestly, I really feel like the clips for the Irresistible Me's are a little less comfortable um, and they feel bulkier. So I wonder if you can kind of tell these almost feel a lot thinner and they lay flatter against my head and these feel pretty bulky um, and there's not as much hair. So, so here is the three clip Irresistible Me. I don't even know if this is focusing. I'm going to do the best I can. And then I should pick it up that way. This is the three clip Bellamy. That didn't really matter to me for the use that I wanted the Irresistible Muse for because this is just, you know, giving my hair a little extra something. Um, but if you, if this is your only pair that you're going to buy, obviously, because they're expensive and most people don't want to buy two pairs or two sets. I'm saying pair a lot. It's really a set. Um, I honestly would go with the Bellamy. Now, with that said, I will say that Bellamy doesn't come in a 16 inch set. Um, they only have longer sets, and then they have a set called the 18-inch Piccolina, and I didn't see that many good reviews on the Piccolina, and um, it looked really thin. Maybe I just need to try them at some point, not anytime soon, because I just bought two sets. <laughs> That's what I noticed. Also, there's another major difference. Here's the forklip left for Bellamy. Really nice, like natural. Oh, these are just really pretty. Oh my gosh, I just love these so much. This just looks so natural. Okay, so here's the four clip weft, and then you can see the sides, very dainty. Okay, now I want to show you the four clip weft from Irresistible Me. This is a freaking monster. This is their signature weft. And it is so bulky. Like, when I have it in my head and you get an itch, you have to do the thing where you slap your head. And that's not great. That's kind of a weird, a weird look. You don't want people to know you're wearing a weave or whatever. So. And the Irresistible Me set has a lot more hair. Um, so you can kind of see, I don't know. It's like, it's in there. So you really don't need a whole lot of wefts when you wear this thing. You just don't. It's a ton of hair. Um, neither set, I use all the wefts. I have a pretty small head, <laughs> so I just don't need all the wefts. I like that because then I feel like I can make them last longer, especially with the, I use the Irresistible Me ones on a day-to-day -day basis, and I don't want to put in all the wefts every single day because I want these to last me a long time. Um, I love the color. Of these they go really well with my ashy tone I will say that this is a very dangerous color because I saw a lot of girls ordering this color and it did not match their hair um, they had more kind of coppery red tones especially at the ends maybe from old color and it was so obvious and even mine has some goldy yellow tones at the very bottom but it actually blends really well um, you can't tell. When I wear these, people have no idea that I'm wearing hair, hair extensions. Um, and it just looks really good with the gray. So if you have any gray in your hair, um, I think that these are a good, a good option for you. If you have old blonde that isn't toned, do not buy this color. It is so finicky. Now this color, my Bambina set, I think this goes... <laughs> Somehow, all my friends, even we, when we all had different hair colors, they worked on all of us, which is kind of funny. It, this is a great, great tone for um, if you have lots of different tones in your hair. I, I love this color, and it looks good on everybody. So if you're trying to pick between the Ash Blonde from Irresistible Me and the Ash Brown from, um, 
from Bellamy, I would definitely say that you have a better chance at matching your hair with this color than this color. This one has so much gray in it, so much ash in it, that you have to be super careful and be sure that you have really, really, really ash hair. So anyway, that's all I'm going to say about that. So how do I take care of them? So what I do is I have this product that my mom got me for Christmas this year called It's a 10 Miracle Shine Spray. I don't, do people do that? I don't know. It's a 10. Um, and it's a heat protectant. And I have the It's a 10 leave-in conditioner and I have a Kenra spray. And this one I like the best because it doesn't leave a bunch of product and it doesn't make it like wet. So um, other hair products that I have for heat protectant kind of make them like stick together at the bottom. But this is just a really nice spray. Ooh. And there you go. They're heat protected. So anyway, I'm going to put these in. I am not going to show you how I put mine in because there are a million YouTube videos out there that will show you a way better way of doing it than I do. I'm still learning. Like I said, I'm new to this whole thing. So I'm going to put mine in the best I can and uh, I'll be right back. Voila! These are the Bellamy set, um, or these are the Bambina Bellamy set. As you can see, they are so long, and I, I seriously can't even imagine why anyone could possibly need 24 inches. If that's you, go for it, but where I live, that would look so, so crazy because these are very, very long. I'm sitting down right now, and the bottom of my hair, which is curled, is hitting the top of my belt. So it's just a lot of hair. By the way, I put these in super sloppy because I'm just trying to get this done. Um, but as you can see, they're gorgeous. They look super natural. Maybe a little stringy at the bottom, but I just need to get them cut to match my hair. Um, they are so comfortable. I'm gonna stand by what I say because I wear the Irresistible Me ones a lot more. These are way, way more hair, but Honestly, I could go through my whole day and not even realize that they're in or forget that they're in. Um, they are just beautiful. They stay in place. Um, honestly, I probably would say that when I get these cut, I'm going to wear them a little more. I love them. They're a great purchase. They, they were, I want to say a hundred, oh, I hate saying this out loud. I think they were $160. But I used my credit card points, so if you have a little extra money for birthday or Christmas or graduation or something like that, this is a fun purchase um, to, to make just to kind of make you feel glamorous when you need to feel glamorous. Now I am going to go put in the Irresistible Me set and I'm going to show you just some of the major differences. You're going to notice a major difference in length, a little bit in color. Um, texture, these are a little softer than these. Not that these are not soft because they're wonderfully soft, but the Bellamy's are a little softer. All right, I'll see you in a sec. Okay, so these are the Irresistible Me Ash Blonde um, in 16 inch, I think 100 grams. And it's a lot of hair and it's beautiful. And I don't really know if you would need the higher set of gr uh, higher weight. Um, these are much heavier feeling on my head, even though it's four inches shorter and actually technically less hair, about a hundred grams less hair. So I do love the color. They're perfect for everyday wear. I love 16 inches because it blends in really nicely with the hair. It gives you just a little bit extra length. Um, mostly it gives you a lot of volume and even a little bit of that balayage effect because this is slightly lighter than my the rest of my hair except for at the top where I have my gray. By the way, I didn't put this in my hair. <laughs> I've had gray hair since I was like 18 years old. So anyway, um, the clips feel a little bit bulkier. So after maybe five hours of wearing these, you're just like, get this off my head. But they're beautiful. So... <laughs> I can deal with it. So I love these hair extensions. They're gorgeous. They're fun to wear. I love Irresistible Me. It's a great company. I had no complaints about um, the time that they were shipped or how they were shipped. Um, I they 
feel great um, in terms of they're soft. They do shed more than the Bellamy's. Um, so what I will say is that if you are thinking about getting either a Bellamy set or an Irresistible Me set, I don't think you could go wrong with either. It just really depends on what you're looking for. If you want something shorter, um, full but short, I would say go with Irresistible Me. If you want something that's longer but has more of a silkier feel to it um, and less heavy up at the top where the clips are, then I would say go with Bellamy. But either, either company is doing great things. I love what they make. I love their products. So it is up to you. And so I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this review um, gave you a little bit more grounding as you make your decision because it is a big decision. They're pretty expensive. So I hope this gives you the information that you're looking for. And um, if you have any interest in me doing another review, I will be happy to do that. So just leave that in the comment section below and I'll read and respond. And, and if y'all are like, hey, never make another video, I'll do that too, maybe. I don't even know if I have time to make another video. I have a full-time job. So anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. My name is Kate, and I'll see you next time.